All right, guys, so here we are in the next process of making this mead. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take this mead and put it into that food grade bucket. And then we're gonna clean out the carboy and then we're gonna put the mead back in. Now what we're doing is right down here at the bottom, there's about two inches of this gulpy bee poop. Basically what it is is what the uh, yeast have eaten and it's just settled to the bottom. It's harmless and whatever. But you really don't want it into your finished product. It doesn't, it won't come out as clear as you need it to be. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to take a little pull off of this um, and get uh, test it, taste it, see how it tastes. See if I need to uh, back sweeten it or anything. Then we're going to stop the video and then when this is uh, done uh, going into there, I'll show you what the bottom looks like before I go clean the carboy. And then we'll come back and um, yeah, we'll show what it looks like getting put back in here for a couple couple minutes. And then the next thing that we're gonna do, because this is not a highly fruited mead, there won't be, I don't think there's gonna be a whole lot of need for a second racking because this stuff is just, it's not really throwing off that much sediment. So we'll see how it goes. And I have some more uh, stuff that will sweeten it and give it more flavor if it needs to. But I think this stuff is just gonna be a really sweet mead. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and test it out. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and take this off. Okay, no gushing. And then what we're gonna do is I'm going to go ahead and turn and face this way. And we're gonna go ahead and stick this racking cane, which has been sanitized with best brewer's iodine. Gonna put that in there. And we will see, we're gonna take this little glass right here and just put a taste in there and see how it comes out. So here we go. Hold on, hold on, let's try that again. Let's get this whole thing going first. Alright, we're going to try that different. I'll be right back. I'm going to go get a different, uh, different hose because this this racking cane just doesn't want to do the job. And from what I can taste out of this, it definitely doesn't need to be uh, redone like that. So what I'm going to do is do this. All right, we're back. We're gonna use this. This is probably gonna be a better way to do it. So, we'll still take a little glass off of it. So we're gonna shake that out. And we're gonna stick this hose all the way down in there if we can. And then we will try this again. Oh, that's got a good taste. I'm gonna try 
it again. try something different here because it's not wanting to work so we're going to go ahead and put this up in the chair hopefully try this where I can get a little fucking traction on this son of a bitch. Pardon. With a little cursing. And then once we get this started I'll stop the video. Because if I don't, then I won't be able to process this. So. We're going to try this again. I've moved it up onto there, so we'll see if you guys can see that. Yeah, cool. Wish me luck. Hopefully this gravity will do what I needed to do. Again. All right, we got the mead coming out. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna stop the video, and I'm gonna go ahead and let this do its job. And then when it gets time, I'll show you what the, the nasty stuff at the bottom looks like. Then we'll clean up the carboy. Do what we got to do to this. And then we'll have it ready to sit for the next couple weeks before we bottle it. Alright, so this is what it looks like when you get down to the yeasties at the bottom. So we're going to clean that out. We're going to get rid of that. And then... Over here, we have the bucket with the mead in it. And uh, we're going to be transferring that back over into the carboy here soon. So, see you when we get that done. Bye. Alright, guys. Well, we've got the mead transferred out. Got rid of all the nasty stuff. And then we put it back into the carboy. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk up here and we're going to go ahead and put the bung back on. And then here in a couple of weeks... We're going, because we've got to let it set. We've got to let it degas and stuff. So what we're going to do is we're going to come back in a couple of weeks, check it out, and if everything looks good, we're going to go ahead and take you to the last process, which is bottling and then aging and drinking. So this is Reverend Smash, Tree Walker, The Order of Standing Oak, and Raven Temple of CX Wicca. Um, join me next time. And if you enjoy these videos and you want to help me out, bring you better content, go ahead and check out our Patreon. We've got a lot of stuff going on over there. And we've got all kinds of new things coming out. So until next time, let's go ahead and put this on here.
get it situated. Step back. And if I must say so, that is a pretty carboy of meat. All right, guys. We'll see you next time.